Horticulture can help contribute to building sustainable livelihoods, improve incomes by providing urban populations with crops such as fruits, vegetables for consumption, and plants for ornamental purposes, while contributing massively to landscaping. The flower and decorative plants industry is experiencing a gradual boost, especially in Nigeria's capital city, Abuja, where cultivators, event planners, flower shop owners are harnessing financial and health benefits. Trust TV's Aisha Salihu reports. Maintaining a balance within the ecosystem ensures proportionality of existence for every organism in the environment. This applies to the sustainable production, maintenance, marketing and cultivating of plants in gardens to produce food and medicinal ingredients or for comfort and ornamental purposes. But Timothy Iji, who has been in this line of work for over a decade, says sourcing, nursing and cultivating these plants is labour and capital intensive. This is because of vast variety of plants and flowers and the different purposes for which they are used. Me that is doing this business, we know the people that I import them from the abroad, we normally buy it from them. So when they bring it, they were like this. I think one is around 4,000, 5,000, depending on the dollars. So I buy it 5,000 each. So I come and transplant it. When I plant it, you know, plant is all about the sizes. Once it grow, the price increases. We have some, some, some plants are herbs. Some are just for decoration. We have a golden palm, we have a tuja, which is called Christmas tree. We have a anglomania, these are indoor. Those that buy flowers, those are the people that build houses, estate and the individual that have houses. So they come to buy, patronize us. When they come, they are the ones that even appreciate us. He acknowledges the health benefits associated with plants and the profitability of the business. Although it's for decoration, but it's the main purpose. When you have plants around your house, you are having a healthy, healthy environment. Sometimes they rent and they return it. And some of them buy and keep it by their asset to maintain it. The horticultural business in the FCT is highly lucrative, hence an untapped gold mine capable of creating employment opportunities to many while beautifying, purifying the environment, removing toxic air pollutants and replacing them with pristine oxygen for humans and animals to thrive. Aisha Salihu, Trust TV News, Abuja.